we're asked to find the perimeter of the triangle. To find the perimeter of any polygon, we need to find the sum of the lengths of all the sides. Notice in this case, the length of each side of the triangle is given as a polynomial, or more specifically, a binomial, which means the perimeter P of the triangle is equal to, let's go ahead and start with this side here. So we have the quantity two X squared plus five inches, plus the quantity negative X squared plus seven X inches, plus the quantity seven X plus nine inches. And we'll leave the units of inches off until after we find the sum. To find the sum of the binomials, we need to combine like terms. Notice how we have two X squared terms, we have two X terms, and we have two constants. And now for the next step, because we're summing the binomials, we can drop the parentheses. Let's write the like terms next to each other. So the perimeter P is equal to two X squared. Now we can write plus negative X squared or just minus X squared. Let's write plus negative X squared. And then we have plus seven X plus seven X. And then finally plus five plus nine. So the perimeter P is equal to two X squared plus negative X squared, or two X squared plus negative one X squared is one X squared or just X squared. And seven X plus seven X is 14 X, so we have plus 14 X. And then five plus nine is 14, so we have plus 14. And to make it clear the units are inches, let's put this quantity in parentheses and then include the units of inches. So the quantity x squared plus 14x plus 14 inches is the perimeter of the triangle. I hope you found this helpful.